Ask the Doctor with Michael Lang begins in 30 seconds. Ask the Doctor with Michael Lang begins in 10 seconds. When it comes to your health, are you seeing the check engine light come on more than normal? It's time to get under the hood. It's time for Ask the Doctor with Dr. Michael Lang. Sponsored by Lang Eye Institute and Fortify Vitamins. Dr. Lang is a board certified optometric physician and certified nutrition specialist, helping people see and feel better through proper nutrition for 25 years. The doctor is in. Call now with your questions at 877-969-8600. That's 877-969-8600. Here's your host, Dr. Michael Lang. Okay, good morning and welcome to Ask the Doctor. I'm Dr. Michael Lang, your host. We're live in the studios here in Salem Media, Tampa Bay. And this is actually a live show. It isn't a uh, you know reprogram from the last hour. So all of you guys and gals listening on Faith Talk, you can actually call and you'll get into me and uh, call. So 570 a.m., 910 a.m., 100.3 FM and 102.1 FM. Uh, all of you guys and gals can give us a call. Remember, this show is dedicated to you, the listener. Um, no matter how simple or complicated your question is, we'll try to answer it to the best of our ability. I'm Dr. Michael Lang. I'm a board certified optometric physician. I'm also a certified nutritional specialist. I've been hosting Ask the Doctor since April of 1993 on multiple radio networks throughout the great country, as well as live video streaming all over the world. So if you have a question regarding nutrition, you have a question regarding your vision and eye care, give us a call. Maybe you've been contemplating having LASIK surgery and you want to know if there's any alternatives. Maybe you want to have cataract surgery and want to know if it's safe. Maybe you just want to know what foods to eat and what vitamins to take to help support your retinal health, your macular health. Is there a supplement that can lower intraocular pressure for you glaucoma patients? So these are a lot of things that we do talk about on this program. Uh, once again, uh, you can give us a call at one 8600 And Doc Hall, my partner in crime. Good morning, Dr. Hall. We're live for the first time. Uh, we've been on Faith Talk for a long time, but it's always been a tape. But we're doing live another hour after our live show. Good morning, Dr. Hall. Well, <laughs> all right, we'll have to see if we can get Doc Hall in a second here. Um, once again, you're listening to Ask the Doctor. Um, we're going to probably uh, have some commercial breaks that are in here that we can take a commercial if we need to, uh, because we might not get a lot of calls since this is a new program. Uh, once again, one 877 We're going to try to see if we can find Doc Hall here in just a second. Remember, I started the Fortify Vitamin Company, and Fortify Vitamin Company's sole purpose is to develop nutraceuticals and supplements to help slow down oxidative stress and inflammation in our body. That's aging, folks. So I work diligently. Doc Hall works diligently. We're in the lab constantly doing studies to try to better the Fortify Vitamin line. Check us out at fortify.com. That's F-O-R-T-I-F-E-Y-E, fortify.com. Uh, come see me today at noon at the Fortify Nutrition Center in Clearwater, Florida. I'll be there for a few hours at noon. Fortify Nutrition Center is on McMullen Booth Road. If you're coming across the causeway, take a ride on McMullen Booth Road. Go down about a mile on the left. Can't miss Publix Plaza. Fortify Nutrition Center is right in there. I'll be there about noon today. And today is what, the last, the last day of July, I think? This is July 31st, or is it? Uh, August 1st. I'm not sure. All right, let's go back to Doc Hall. No, I, I'm not, I don't see Doc Hall there. Um, yet, Doc Hall, are you there? <laughs> we'll see if we can call Doc Hall and try to get him back in here um, in just a minute. But we're going to uh, be talking about your eye care and vision. If you've got a question, give me a call at one 877 
Uh, we're just trying to get Doc Hall back on the phone here. Um, and here we go. one 969 8600 And Doc Hall's phone number is, I'm giving it to my engineer here. He's going to call him, get him back on the line. Live, it's hard to do this in live, uh, live at the same time. So oh, a little while ago, um, the first hour, we were talking about dry eye syndrome, how everybody and anybody out there has some issues with dry eye. So that means your eyes at some time are going to feel sandy, gritty, burn, tear, itch, all right, and fluctuation in vision. All of this is related to dry eye, okay? And you very well may um, need to use some artificial tears periodically in your eye. But are there other things that you can do? And I'm famous for saying this. Yes, indeed. There's a five-step approach for dry eye. We heat the lids up, so a hot compress. We clean the lids before bedtime. Uh, We neutrify the glands with omega-3 fish oil, but you want the triglyceride form omega-3 fish oil, okay? Like Fortify Super Omega or Fortify Super Omega Max. And you got to use the right lubrication. And that's the big question, the right lubrication. The majority of artificial tears you buy over the counter are like the majority of vitamins. They don't have much therapeutic benefit. So... Uh, there's three artificial tears I really like, and there's two that I like the best. Optase, Oasis Tears Plus are my two favorite, and Fresh Coat is my third favorite. So you can get those on the Fortify website at fortify.com, F-O-R-T-I-F-E-Y-E. And then the other fifth piece of the puzzle for dry eye is actually so that you can um, hydrate. Most of us are dehydrated. Drink more water. I like Wata water the best. And also good spring water. Drink half your body weight in ounces of water. So we're getting ready to go back to the phone in just a second. Doc calls online again. But remember, if dry eye, um, artificial tears, um, heat them up, clean them, and neutrify them and drink plenty of fluids. You can go to our website at fortify.com and there's some uh, special kits, dry eye kits, super dry eye kit, extreme dry eye kit, where we put everything into one thing. All right. Let's go back to the phones. Doc Hall, we lost you. I think we got you back. Are you there, my friend? I am here. I had a problem with my headphones, so we got that all raked out. So we're all set. We're real. Uh, I didn't wasn't able to hear what uh, what you were talking about, but I just wanted to uh, to remind folks that this month is actually uh, Dry Eye Awareness Month, and uh, we're doing something about that. Uh, as I tell everybody, when it comes to dry eye and macular uh, degeneration like that you're the guy you're the you're the guru out there and it's not because i'm supposed to say that or i have to say that or whatever it's just true for me and uh, so folks if you have dry eye problems and like that dr lang is the one and uh, and we have some special kits uh, um, uh, that are just excellent for that and we see good results about them every day and uh, so stay tuned we got some good things coming up all right. Uh, once again, I'm trying to get us live on a few other of these uh, social medias that uh, we lost. Um, well, Dr. Lang, if you'd like, um, I, I have the, uh, the fall in uh, balance. Yes. Uh, Let's talk about with. that. Okay. Uh, I, I just want to address a concern that I know is, is on many of our listeners' minds, uh, and that is losing balance and falling. Uh, I hear it. Dr. Lang hears it. Uh, and we hear this all the time. I don't want to fall down and I don't want to break a hip. Of course, we don't want you to, to go through that experience. We don't want to want you to do that. And Dr. Lang and I have come up with some, some very good protocols to, uh, to help you get through that. And, uh, it's, it's not inevitable, folks. Um, uh, we're both specialists in the anti-aging field and, uh, and it's an ongoing project for us. Uh, most people say, well, Dr. Hall, I'm getting older and the inevitable fall is just around the corner. And, you know, that comes with age. Whoa, whoa wait a minute. Uh, not so fast. Uh, most certainly we, uh, we see a dramatic rise in balance issues and falling as we age. But my theory has always been uh, uh, that these conditions are not necessarily a product of aging, but rather a change in lifestyle. Okay, if it's a change in lifestyle, folks, we can do something about that. 
All right, there are so many things uh, you can do to change this and to a positive, uh, and we can help. Um, there's products out there that, uh, that can certainly help. And the balance issue and falling in like that, a lot of times, folks, that comes from something very simple. Okay, it's not a complex issue. Is you've lost muscle strength. You've lost muscle in your legs and your hips. And, and, uh, and you lose balance because there's just no strength left there. Okay. Does that come with aging? Yeah, a little bit. But you know what? It mainly comes from a lifestyle problem, um, or lifestyle issues, rather, I should say. And you've had a change. You know, I mean, as we, as we grow older, our lives change. My life is not what it was when I was 25 years old. Uh, same with you. And, uh, it's changes. Now it could be good. It could be bad. Okay, but we can have an effect on that when you you have to build muscle, folks, to the last day that God gives you on this earth. Okay, that's part of the deal. All right. You just can't give up and say, well, I've turned 50. I've turned 60. I've turned 70. And so, you know, I just don't have to worry about muscle. Yes, you do. You most certainly do. Uh, to, to compose your balance and like that, folks, you need leg strength. You need overall body strength to do that. Um, how do you do that? Um, you have to grow the muscle. What grows the muscle? Protein. All right. We have two of the best proteins I've ever seen, a protein concentrate and a protein isolate. Of course, we'll explain those to you at some point or maybe even later in the show. But uh, our fit, uh, the ultimate muscle fuel, is one of the best things I've ever seen for this. We have to fortify your body, folks. Okay. We have to build that body. We just can't let it, you know, take it, uh, uh, well, it's, you know, it's with age. No, no, I'm not buying that. I'm not going to let you buy that, all right? We need to fight back a little bit. And uh, and it's very simple. You know, we, we have to work on those muscles. And we have two very, very good products to help you do that. Now, with that said, it's not just all about products. Uh, there are some very good classes out there you can take at your local gym, your YMCA's, at your health centers, at your community centers. They have them on balance. They have them on muscle building, muscle control, and things like that. I advise to get into those. I mean, I really do. You know, you need to strengthen up those legs and, and the whole entire body, and you'll feel better all the way around. So, you know, take a, a proactive approach to your balance and that risk of falling. Nobody wants to walk around with that risk on your mind all the time. Oh, my goodness, I better not get up and, and uh, go to the refrigerator or go for a walk because I'm going to fall down. Of course, those are concerns, but let's alleviate some of that concern and get you back into the, the positive line and check out our proteins and check out our fit. If you have questions, you can always call us one way or the other. Uh, we want to help. And we're here to help. That's what we do. Dr. Lang and I are committed to the anti-aging process. We're committed to this this falling and, and lack of balance and, and like that. We're committed to those. We've been studying those for decades, and we can help. Okay, so give us a call. And uh, we're glad you're with us for the second uh, second portion of the show today. It's, uh, it's good. And uh, we hope to do it quite often and maybe on a regular basis. Yep. Thanks, Doc Call. Um, and you're listening to Ask the Doctors. Remember, I've been hosting Ask the Doctor on multiple radio networks throughout the great country since April of 1993, nonstop. A lot of you used to listen to me uh, when we were live uh, at a drive time show, 9 o'clock in the morning here in Tampa Bay for about 10 years, uh, called Ask the Doctor. But anyway, phone lines are open. We're alive, 1-877-969-8600. Give us a call, 1-877-969-8600. 8600. We're broadcasting through the Faith Work, Faith Talk Network, Salem Media uh, today. Uh, in the first hour, we're all over the country and live video streaming all over the world. Uh, Doc Hall brings up a good question. You know, as we age, even when we are younger, we're not, not getting the right amount of protein in the right levels, okay? And so that's why we developed these whey proteins. We've got uh, Fortify Super Protein and chocolate and in vanilla. These are all naturally flavored. No sucralose, no aspartame, no dyes. Um, New Zealand grass-fed cows are our super protein. And then our whey protein isolate is American grass-fed cows. I always tell people when they're looking for a protein, when you're going to buy a protein over the counter at your vitamin store, make sure it says three things. Non-denatured, that means it hasn't been heated and destroyed um, and hasn't been used acid on it. Make sure you know where the cows come from. American, Australian, New Zealand, French, those are all very good cows. 
If it doesn't say where the cows come from, chances are it's coming from China. Do you really want to put that in your body? And make sure it says grass-fed. So non-denatured, where the cows come, grass-fed. If it has all those, then it's a good, 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 good protein. It doesn't really matter if it's a concentrate or an isolate. As long as it has at least 20 grams of protein, you're going to be very good with that. You can actually make a smoothie with these, okay? Um, but it's very good for you to get this protein to help, like Doc Haw said, build muscle at any age, strength and endurance. But what people don't realize, whey protein is not only for your muscles, okay? It is for your immune system. It's very high in something called covalent bonded cysteine that converts to the master antioxidant glutathione. It's very high in lactoferrin. It's very high in CLA and very high in immunoglobulins. So that's what makes whey protein so much better than pea protein and soy protein and rice protein. Remember, most vegetable proteins are not complete proteins. Whey protein is a complete protein, has all the essential, the non-essential, and the branch chain amino acids in it, which are crucial for boosting muscle synthesis, muscle recovery, uh, and, you know, helping you to be strong until you have two feet in the grave. Now, Doc Hall and I worked for two and a half years on a product called Fortify Fit. F-I-T stands for Fortify Intense Training. We developed this originally for athletes. But our biggest segment of the population that's taking it is over 70 years of age. Fortify Fit is helping patients maintain their strength. It's helping them decrease sarcopenia. That's muscle wasting. If you're stronger, you're less likely to fall. Remember, the falls are what put us in the grave early. It really is. So look at our Fortify Fit. It's a combination of 10 nutrients. It's collagen protein to help the scaffolding of our body. The collagen helps the ligaments, the tendons, the joints, the skin, the hair, and the nails. It's creatine that helps muscle. It helps strength. It helps energy levels because it helps produce ATP. That's adenosine triphosphate. That's energy. But for you all elderly patients, it actually helps to combat against neurodegeneration, cognitive decline. Also, for you athletes, it helps decrease the chance of you having traumatic brain injuries and concussions. We have D-ribose, betaine and hydrose, L-citrulline, cluster dextrin, velocitol, branch chain amino acids, and the most potent antioxidant in the world called astaxanthin, all in the Fortify Fit for $46. There is nothing like it on the market right now. I'm going to brag, nothing like it. If the typical vitamin company was going to make this, it would be close to $200 because they want a good markup. We don't even double the price. It gets better. You can buy the Fit Bundle where you get three Fortify Fits and a shaker for $100 plus free shipping. Check it out on the website, fortify.com, or you can call Arlene at Fortify. The toll-free number is 866-503-9746. 866-503-9746. The phone lines are starting to ring. I think we had Andy on hold. We're going to have to go back to Andy in a minute. We lost him. Andy, give us a call back and I'll take you next. But let's go to John in Newport, Richie. John, thanks for holding. Good morning. Good morning. I'd like to ask you, please, when do I not need to use eye drops? Aha. Uh -huh. Well, it all depends. If we're talking about lubricating eye drops, is that the type of drop you're talking about? Yes, yes. Yeah, so the, I, the, the eye drops or the gel. Right. So, I beg your pardon. The instant you wake up in the morning, your eyes are driest when you sleep at night. So right when you wake up in the morning, go ahead and put a good drop like Optase, Oasis Tears, right when you wake up, all right? That's going to help lubricate your eyes for the day because when you wake up, your eyes are very dry and you start blinking 20,000 times in a, a day, that starts to slough epithelial cells off and it can cause pain, irritation, burning. It can cause scarring and blurred vision. So the instant you wake up, put it in. And then usually around supper time, your eyes start to dehydrate. So I recommend twice a day at the minimum, okay? But anytime your eyes feel sandy, gritty, burn, tear, itch, or fluctuation in vision, you can use those lubricants. Try to get preservative-free. Yeah. My favorite are Optase and Oasis Tears Plus. Yeah. It's, it's, it's an instant when you shouldn't use eye drops. I mean, if you're not feeling any irritation or anything like that. Right. Yeah. It, it, there's an old saying, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, John. So if you don't have any symptoms, your eyes feel great and you have good vision, there's no reason to put any drops in your eyes. OK, I typically no. recommend first thing in the morning, no matter what, because it's like when you start your piston motor up in the car, you got to have a little oil on the cylinder so it doesn't seize up. So if you uh -huh. if you put a drop in the eye first thing in the morning, even if you don't have any symptoms, 
then chances are you're going to do much better through the day. Okay. And then, uh, and then uh, at bedtime, at night time. Yep. It's not a bad well. idea. Or must most of us men get up a few times during the night to go to the bathroom, right? Yeah. So yeah. if you put a drop in when you wake up in the middle of the night, that's a good idea. I usually have a bottle of water and some artificial tears by the bed. And I go to the bathroom and then I drink a cup of water and I put some artificial tears in my eye. And I'm pretty good for the oh. morning. Okay. Is it good directly before bed or an hour before bed? Yeah, I would say directly, right before you go to bed. Just right before you go to okay. bed. Put your put your drops in, say your say your uh, prayers and go to bed. Okay. All right. I appreciate your help. Many thanks. All right, John. Take care. Bye bye. All right, you're listening to Ask the Doctors, 1-877-969-8600. We're broadcasting from Salem Media here on the Faith Talk Network. Uh, it's Dr. Hall and myself, Dr. Michael Lang. Let's go back to the phones. I think we got Andy back. Andy, thanks for holding. Good morning. Dr. Lang, how are you guys today? Fabulous. Uh, good, good. I appreciate you the second hour. I thought I uh, to call and ask um, about gut biome which um, friends tell me that your GI tract is like a second brain uh, sort of influencing what you eat and what types of food you're looking for to satisfy certain cravings that even uh, the bacteria, both healthy or unhealthy in your GI tract, can dictate your eating behavior. And then secondly, uh, muscle cramps. I wake up every single morning with uh, my left or right foot cramping up and I think it has to do with how my back or my neck is on a pillow or something. Because if I'm in a car for an extended period of time, like when you're racing, I don't know if you've ever experienced some cramping of muscles by how you're sitting. Oh, yeah. Your little back. Yeah. So what remedies do you recommend other than I will buy to the boxes of Highland sublingual um, anti-cramping pills? And I, I buy about a two, box or two of those a week. Sure. And um I recently just um, got some liquid blue-green algae, and I swigged it in my mouth, and it really calmed down after uh, I swallowed it. The muscles on my uh, left uh, foot that were cramped up like they're making a fist, and about three or four minutes of sublingual having some kind of algae uh, in my mouth um, and the amino acids or something, and when I swallowed it, bam, they, my, my toes opened right up within about three or four minutes better than the cramping pills. So I thought maybe you could talk awesome. about muscle cramps because Dr. Hall and you are working out quite a bit and you're hitting the sauna after you go to the yep. gym. And Go ahead, Doc. Absolutely. So I'm going to address the microbiome and I'm going to let Doc Hall in a minute address cramping. But I'm just going to feed something in about cramping really quick. A lot of times, potassium and magnesium deficiencies in dehydration. So eat a banana and an avocado, a handful of pumpkin seeds that has sprouted and drink plenty of good water uh, that will help with the cramping, but I'm going to let Doc Hall chime in a lot more about that in just a second. Let's talk about the microbiome. And yes, the microbiome is like your second brain, maybe even your first brain. The microbiome is the gut, all right? It's the bacteria in the gut. And if we do not have the proper bacterial flora in our gut, I mean, our, our whole body goes to hell in a handbasket. Cognitive decline, energy decline, uh, muscle wasting, I mean... Fat everywhere, okay? Uh, more Our immune system goes down. We get sick more frequently. So that's why it's crucial to have a healthy microbiome, a healthy gut flora. And that's why I always recommend people eating daily some fermented food and maybe even some pickled food, okay? Don't overdo the pickled food, but fermented food. I love goat kefir and goat yogurt. Better than regular yogurt and regular kefir from, from dairy because most dairy has a genetically mutated beta casein protein called an A1 beta casein protein that is affiliated with leaky gut, diabetes, cancer, and autism. So if you're going to drink dairy, stay with goat dairy or A2 cow's milk, anything like that. That's why I love goat uh, kefir and goat yogurt. And you can buy it at some of these grocery stores now. Uh, sauerkraut in moderation is good. So um, there's a lot of fermented foods that can help uh, put the good bacteria back into our body. It's not a bad idea to supplement with probiotics and prebiotics. There's some foods you can eat that are very high in prebiotics. Asparagus, artichokes, onions, garlic, leeks, um, and believe it or not, pistachios aren't bad, okay? Uh, that's one of the mm -hmm. nuts and seeds that I allow people to eat. So these foods are high in prebiotics that feed the probiotics. So eat some fermented food, a little pickle food. Eat those foods I just mentioned. Maybe consider taking three fortify probiotic bacteria a day. 
And then you got to stay away from the bad stuff. I mean, the chlorinated and the fluorinated water, because that can kill off the bacterial flora in your gut. Antibiotics, if doctors prescribe antibiotics to you, uh, those may be beneficial for killing off bacteria, but they can kill off the good bacteria in your gut. So you not you need to take probiotics and eat some of these fermented foods more so when you're on um, uh, these antibiotics. So um, that's a whole uh, talk show talking about the microflora in the gut. But it's true. You get all sorts of weird cravings. If you do not have a healthy microbiome, <laughs> You can crave M&Ms and Hershey's and all sorts and, and, you know, wine and beer, all the stuff that's not good for you. Remember, all of that in moderation is OK, Andy. Uh, but talking yes, about exactly. cramping, cramping can be a big problem as we get older. If you're an athlete at any age, I mean, you can have horrendous cramps, especially at night when you're sleeping. Some that feel like there's a sword going through your calf muscle and things like that. But I'm going to let Doc call because right. he's an, an expert in this area as well. Thank you. Well, Dr. Lang, and thank you for the for the call too. That's that's right on the money with that good question. And uh, I found a few things over the years uh, being an athlete and like that. And of course, as the caller noted, uh, Dr. Lang and I are both. Uh, uh, he has a sauna at, at his place, and I have one at my place. And uh, so I'm in the sauna a couple times a day sometimes, and I'm always working out or doing something. I'm a, I'm an outdoors type person, as is Dr. Lang. He's, he's even more than me. But uh, we're sweating all the time, and we're giving up uh, the electrolytes, which that's the minerals in our body, and we need those folks. Those aren't minor. Uh, back many, many years ago, they were looked at, you know, well, the vitamins are the important thing, and the minerals, well, don't worry about those. No, we have to worry about those. Um, that's magnesium, potassium, calcium, all of those things we sweat out, okay? And those are regulators for our bodies. They regulate everything from heartbeat to how much water is needed and water regulation in the body and blood pressure and all kinds of things. So minerals are real important. And I'll tell you one thing I've found, um, uh, and I, we're going to start stocking this, I hope, pretty soon. I've got some lines out there that I, that I really want to bring in for us that are very helpful, and especially uh, to athletes and to our seniors. And one thing is, uh, is magnesium salt. It's a spray. And um, you get a cramp or you get uh, the sore muscle and, and like that. I even have... Uh, um, massage therapist and like that, using it as a pre-massage type thing. And uh, uh, and it works. It really does work. And you can pick it up. But uh, hopefully we're going to be selling this, especially in the Clearwater store and online and like that. Uh, but it's a magnesium salt. And, uh, of course, you know, as Dr. Lang always says, you know, uh, use this, uh, um, you know, as you will. Uh, you know, it, it, it's for your your purpose and, you know, work with your doctor. If you there's a reason you shouldn't take it or like that, of course, you know, we're not your doctor sitting in your living room or in our office. So we don't know. We don't know all those particulars, but that's just one product that can help. But definitely the uh, magnesium, potassium, the electrolyte, that whole panel, that's going to help a lot. And massage and things like that help, too. And uh, but keep those uh, cramps in, uh, in the, the, the old fashioned. Uh, I haven't heard this term for a long time. Uh, Charlie horse. Um, and boy, those can be just horrific. They can wake you up in the middle of the night. Well, there's something going on. And really, folks, that's a signal to you that there's something going on in your body. Your body needs something. And, and that, that muscle seizing up like that, that's telling the brain, well, you got to look into that. So don't just let it pass by. Um, and there's some things you can do to, uh, to remedy that whole situation. Absolutely. Thank you, Dr. And, and uh, and, uh, Andy. A follow-up uh, question? Yeah. Um, uh, my friend uh, who just moved to Michigan, um, she's really fit, okay, and like zero body fat. She eats only organic and everything in a blender, nothing out of a can, you know, nothing prepackaged, okay? Um, anyway, she's a workout fiend, too, every day. So she just got a, a acupressure or, or a tie, some kind of massage, as she said, was the most unbelievable. And uh, this girl walked up and down her back or whatever, but she recommended it. And I didn't know if either of you, as professionals and experienced in you know, fitness and stuff, have a particular type of massage you would recommend for people who are starting to um, you know, get their body toned up and, and work out. And uh, not that it's, it's a luxury, okay, for most people, but sometimes it's necessary therapeutically. So is there a particular kind of massage? Yeah, that's a great question, Andy. I mean, and, and both Doc Holler 
are very familiar with massage because we've used it for uh, benefits over the years. And I got to tell you, uh, for helping reduce uh, muscle cramping, helping reduce uh, um, sciatica that a lot of people get, one of the best type of mu- is deep tissue massage, all right? But with deep tissue right. massage, you got to be very careful. You got to make sure you hydrate before and hydrate after because it can help cause you to dehydrate. And so deep tissue massage is what I recommend. Um, you got to find somebody that really knows what they're doing to do a good job. But most athletes, deep tissue massage is really good for the muscles. Uh, you know, not right after, maybe a couple of days after uh, having a workout. You don't want to go in when you're extremely sore. But hopefully, if you're recovering properly, you're never extremely sore. And that's where our Fortify Fit comes in, helping people to recover. So I like deep tissue massage. Let me chime back to uh, talking about cramping. You know, my daughter is an unbelievable volleyball athlete, indoor and beach volleyball. She's really going more toward beach now. Um, She's ranked 17th in the country right now in beach volleyball. And I got to tell you, the beach volleyball athletes, you know, they're one of the athletes that they could get dehydrated more than anybody. They're playing out there in 104 degree temperature, sometimes hotter than that, sweating a lot, direct sunlight. And there's a few things that are great to help reduce cramping if you're an athlete at any time. Believe it or not, watermelon and put some salt on it. You got to have the sodium. Watermelon and salt. Remember, watermelon is high in L-citrulline that converts to nitrous oxide. It also has a a fast-acting glycemic index, so it gives you energy. Watermelon and salt, great uh, for that. Coconut water and a little pink Himalayan sea salt. Coconut water is very high in electrolytes, but it's not high in the sodium. So if you're sweating, you gotta replenish that sodium. And a lot of people are using pickle juice, okay? Pickle juice is not bad. The only problem with pickle juice, if you're getting a little bit older, it's super high in sodium, probably too much sodium. (laughs) So it's great for athletes out there. Pickle juice is good, but you gotta be very careful if you're over 50, because sometimes too much salt can trigger AFib, uh, and, and, and it's kind of a double edged sword, but coconut water, a little sea salt, watermelon with a low sea salt is very, very safe. What Dr. is so Mike? special? Um, you, you both about Thai massage. Is that one of the better massages to get? Doc, you, you called it deep tissue. Yep. Doc Hall, you want to chime in about, you know, Thai massage versus deep tissue. I'm not sure what the difference is. A massage therapist could call in and chime in and, and let us know. Absolutely. I'm, I'm a big fan as, as a bodybuilder over all the, the years and like that. I've built up some good muscle and uh, it takes somebody to get in there uh, into those muscles to, for me to get some relief and really get a good massage. So I don't like what I call a surface massage. It feels good uh, to do that, but it really doesn't get in there and, and get done what I, what I like. So I really am a big fan of, of deep tissue massage. One thing, Andy, I want to want to suggest uh, to your friend too. Uh, since she's she's uh, as you said a, a, a fitness freak or a fitness a uh, uh, holic, so to speak, um, uh, our fit uh, uh, recovery. It's a pre and post workout. Um, I would highly highly suggest that for her because what she has to watch is this. She's got that the workouts nailed down. I'm sure. Okay, but what she has to watch is the recovery. If she doesn't recover properly, properly, she opens herself up for injury, for uh, range of motion issues, for um, uh, onset uh, uh, of muscle fatigue and muscle soreness, DOMS. And uh, uh, so this can alleviate a lot of that. One of the things that is now my new go-to favorite, and I do it, I have a lot of lawn to mow, and I don't, I don't use a riding lawnmower, I use a push mower, the old school, and I get my exercise, my little bit of cardio from that. <laughs> But as soon as I get in, the first thing that I do is is I take watermelon. I don't like watermelon to eat it, uh, uh, I, just the texture of it, I guess, or something. But I will blend that up in the blender, just watermelon, and I put our, our Fortify Fit, the strawberry watermelon flavor, in with that. And, oh, my gosh, it, it's something I really look forward to. And, and I bounce right back. I mean, it's, it has everything in there for recovery. So I would highly, highly recommend that for her and she would see a difference. And, uh, but it, going back to the massage and like that, you know, if, if you're really a hardcore work, uh, trainer and, and things like that, or, you know, you're using your muscles, uh, to a great degree, I like the, the deep tissue massage. Uh, but again, as Dr. Lang said, you know, use that protocol of hydrating pre and post, and that's going to help you a lot with that. Yeah, it's probably hard to find um, massage therapists that specialize in that. Um, 
And so if you ever want to interview somebody who's into and can define the difference between tie and deep tissue and go into it a little bit, that would be um, very helpful on your program. And awesome. stuff. And I'm so glad you got the second Absolutely. hour. All Absolutely. right, Eddie. Thanks for the call. We appreciate it. Always. Thank you both. All right. Have a good one. Thanks, Eddie. And I got to say, we got uh, Jennifer chiming in on social media here. I had Charlie horses all the time until I started Fortify Fit. I drink it right uh, at night, no more cramps at all. So I've had a lot of patients that have said the same thing. They get these terrible Charlie horses in their feet and their, and their calves at night, and they've been drinking the Fortify uh, Fit, and it's helped dramatically. Remember, the Fortify Fit has collagen that helps the ligaments, the tendons, the joints, and the muscles, the branch chain amino acids for the muscle, the creatine but L-citrulline, which improves the circulation. Astaxanthin, the most potent antioxidant, anti-inflammatory known to man. So what better for anti-aging and helping reduce cramps and build muscle than something that's going to uh, target the scaffolding of the body, that's the ligaments, tendons, joints, you know, skin, hair, and nails, target the muscles, all right, with the creatine, the branched chain amino acids, and the betaine and hydros, and improve circulation with the L-citrulline and lower inflammation and oxidative stress in all the tissues with the astaxanthin. And at the same time, give you energy because of the D-ribose um, and everything else in it. So it's been carefully thought out. Doc, and Hall, Doc Hall and I worked on it for two and a half years. Fortify Fit, the ultimate muscle fuel, daily pre and post-workout formula, nutritional support for muscle synthesis, strength, and endurance, and for building a powerful immune system. So I want everybody out there to check it out. I recommend it to just everybody at any age. Um, you know, as we age, you know, think about it. We get a little fatter. We get a little weaker. We get less energy. We get tired. And we think it's a normal process of aging. It's not necessary. I mean, if you eat the right foods, you get a right amount of sleep, you hydrate and take the right supplements, okay, you're going to do very, very well. And I say the right supplements. Doc Hall is famous for saying we're equally as proud of what does not go in our Fortify products as what does go in it. So Fortify Fit, if you look at most pre-workout and post-workout, by the way, we're the only pre-workout and post-workout that's all in one formula that's naturally flavored. All of those have sucralose, aspartame, dyes, carrageenan that have negative impact on you, but it's inexpensive and it makes it taste very good. So check it out, Fortify Fit. Check out the Fortify Fit bundle at fortify.com. And check out the performance stacking bundle that gives you the Fortify Fit and your choice of one of our proteins. Remember, the ultimate is the Fortify Fit with a scoop of the Fortify Protein right after you work out. There isn't anything better, and it works. I mean, Doc Hall and I are in some of the best shape of our life. I mean, you should see Doc Hall. He's got 21-inch pythons, and he's, you know, he's older than me, and I'm 59. So we're both in the gym. We're working out. We're stronger than we were when we were 25. And so you can, in my opinion, slow down the aging or reverse the aging to a certain extent if you do the things that we talk about in this program. All right, we're going to open up the phone lines. If you've got a question, 1-877-969-8600. Give us a call. Consultation is free. 1-877-969-8600. Remember, I'll be live at Fortify Nutrition Center in Clearwater today at noon. Doc Hall is going to be live in the studios with me next week before we go to Sebring. Doc Hall is on the pit crew, and I'm racing on Sebring next Sunday. But we're going to do a live show here with him in the studio. Then we'll go do a live uh, appearance for an hour before we get in the motor coach and head to Sebring at the Fortify Nutrition Center. Remember, Fortify Nutrition Center is on McMullen Booth Road in Clearwater. You drive right across the Tampa Bay Causeway. Go to McMullen Booth Road, make a right, go down about a mile on the left. There's a Publix Plaza. You can't miss it. Fortify Nutrition Center. I'll be there at noon for a couple of hours today. Today is July, I don't know, the end of July. All right. Um, one more time. Phone lines are open. 1-877-969-8600. That's 1-877-969-8600. All right. Somebody just asked me on uh, Instagram. Uh, what is that artificial tear that you've been recommending for the last few weeks? It's called Optase, O-P-T-A-S-E, Optase. It's a preservative-free in a dropper bottle, not an individual vial, and it works quite well. It lubricates the eye. It helps you see better. I put a drop of that before I get in the race car 
I don't want my eyes to get dried out if I'm going 200 miles an hour with a car one foot behind me and one foot in front of me. I want to see clearly, right? And the second part of that question was, and what's the drop called that makes the eyelid bagginess go away? That's called upneak. You can talk to your optometrist or ophthalmologist, come to the Lang Eye Institute in the villages where I hail from and see if you're a candidate for it. Upneak is a drug you put in your eye and it interfaces or it, 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 it actually absorbs into the, the muscles that are responsible for your eyelids being baggy and lifts them by 35%. And it works. Doc Hall, you've tried both the Optase Lubricating Eye Drop and the Upneak. And tell me, it worked pretty good, didn't it? Absolutely. I, I use uh, Optase every day. Use it in the morning. And I use it, as you mentioned earlier, right before I go to bed. My eyes are great. Uh, as you know, neither one of us uh, have a prescription uh, glasses. Uh, I do wear the, uh, the blue light uh, uh, blocker lenses. And they're fantastic. I mean, my, my I don't get that afternoon fatigue in my eyes anymore. And uh, but that's just from taking good eye care too. Uh, we, you know, you as as an eye doctor, of course, have always taken good care of your eyes. And and you and I being good friends, you look after my eye care. I don't trust them to anybody else but to you. And uh, uh, and we get good results. Now the um, uh, the Upneak, absolutely love it. Uh, I'm I'm the uh, the company, I guess, uh, for lack of a better word, uh, test a subject or guinea pig. And uh, anything that Dr. Lang has new coming in, I don't care if it's a procedure or a drop or a supplement or what. Hey, Doc, come here. I want you to try something. And uh, and I get pulled into a side uh, room and, and uh, briefed on it, and off we go. But I tried uh, Upneak, and, I've, and I use it now. And it absolutely does work. I mean, I can see a difference in my eyes really within about 20 minutes. Uh, I use it. I, I do a lot of personal appearances, and, and it's not an ego thing or a vain thing or whatever, but you want to look your best. You know, and this helps me do that. Uh, I do a lot of bodybuilding shows and things. I'm on stage. I'm on big screens. And I want to look the best I can. And uh, and this helps, folks. It really does help. No stinging, no burning, no after effects, no bad anything of either of those products. Two other quick things I want to say. Uh, with the Fit, we even designed a special shaker that that product is special we had to design a special shaker and you can go online and take a look at it it's it's a two-sided shaker it works fantastic and but we just got those back in stock too so we have those available and dr Lang, one thing i i just we we use the the uh estesanthin in, in several of our our products would you please just take maybe a minute or two and explain the importance of uh estesanthin uh, to our to our listeners Absolutely. Astaxanthin is the most potent natural anti-inflammatory and antioxidant known to man. It's what gives wild Alaskan salmon its orange color. That's why wild Alaskan is, salmon is so good for you. You saute it in co oak, organic coconut oil. It's a good source of protein. It's a good source of omega-3 that's good for us. And it's a good source of astaxanthin. Our number one nutrient that has it in it is called Fortify Focus. Fortify Focus, everybody should be on that if you're a kid or if you're an elderly person. Fortify Focus has lutein, zeaxanthin isomers, and astaxanthin. So the lutein and zeaxanthin cross the blood retinal barrier, get into the macula, and protect the macula against blue light. It increases what we call macula pigment density. And so we're protecting from the harmful blue light that's emitted from the iPhone, the iPad, the digital lights, the television, even the sun. So Fortify Focus has lutein and zeaxanthin to impregnate into the macula, help the damaging effects, decrease the damaging effects of uh, the blue light, but also it has the astaxanthin. In a therapeutic dosage, six milligrams, astereal astaxanthin, the most studied astaxanthin, that actually impregnates and gets into the front part of the eye, not into the retina. It does improve choroidal cir circulation, lowers oxidative stress and inflammation, but improves the focusing ability in the eye dramatically. So I'm 58, 59 years old, and I don't need reading glasses. When I was 48, I did. I take two Fortify Focus a day. So Fortify Focus is amazing for people that are on the computer a lot because it reduces accommodative stress. It reduces focusing fatigue, something called computer vision syndrome, and protects you at the same time from the blue light. Women are going to love this. Another added bonus of the triple uh, uh, carotenoid, lutein, zeaxanthin, and astaxanthin, that's one of the best things in the world for your skin, okay? For your joints, 
for your heart, your brain, even your cholesterol levels. When you combine that with a good omega-3, like Fortify Super Omega, then it also lowers triglycerides and lowers inflammation even more. So I recommend Fortify Super Omega and Fortify Focus, the combination of those two. Remember, aging is inflammation and oxidation. So what better way to combat against some of these age-related changes by combating against inflammation and oxidation with Fortify Focus and Fortify Super Omega? You can check them out at Fortify dot com. But the other thing about astaxanthin, not only for the eye, it improves muscle endurance and muscle recovery. It helps dry eye too. So that's why we put it in the Fortify Fit. We were one of the first to use astaxanthin in a pre-post-workout supplement. And that's another reason why Fortify Fit is so beneficial because you're, you're combating against oxidative stress and inflammation. Uh, but it's improving muscle endurance and muscle recovery when it's combined with the other nine nutrients. Like I said, there really isn't anything like Fortify Fit on the market, and that's why it's gotten such national and international recognition, and it's selling like hotcakes all over the place. So um, once again, we do have time for another call or two, 1-877-969-8600, 1-877-969-8600. You're listening to Ask the Doctors this morning. Dr. Michael Lang with Dr. Richard Hall. I'm a board-certified optometric physician, a certified nutritional specialist. Dr. Hall, a uh, PhD in clinical nutrition, and um, he is has certified in just about every aspect of sports nutrition, icon in the sports nutrition industry. I can remember uh, watching Doc Hall lecture at conferences on sports nutrition 25, 30 years ago, and now he's on the Fortify Vitamin Team, the Performance Vision Team. He runs the Lang Nutrition Center in Ocala. He's an asset to the whole team here. Uh, once again, we're getting ready to take another call here in just a second. Um, if you guys uh, are bored, come out Sunday, next Sunday to Sebring. It's a performance driving group uh, a warm-up race. And so they divide it up into uh, novice, intermediate, and advanced, advanced pro. I'll be running in the, in the advanced class in the Fortify Viper. So uh, you can come over to our motor coach. We have it set up with lots of chairs and We'll probably have some food and drink and everything for all of you guys out there. And Doc Hall is going to be helping to change the tires. Doc Hall, uh, I think you're going to be pretty excited coming to the race. And maybe uh, I'll take you for some laps uh, at 200 miles an hour. It's a good way to uh -huh. boost adrenaline and beta endorphins to reduce pain. My my adrenaline is is already boosted now, and we're a week away from being there. You know, so I'm I'm really looking forward to it. It's going to be a good weekend. We get to hang out together and and like that. So uh, uh, off we go. And uh, while while we're talking, uh, I just want to wish a very special person a happy birthday, and that's to your beautiful wife Tammy. And uh, uh, I want to say one thing too. I feel you know we're we're not just friends and best friends. We're family. And it's really nice. Uh, your mom is just like my mom. I love being around her. And we have some of the best fun times and talking. She's my mom's the same age. They're, they're in that 93, 94 year age and they're both doing well. And, uh, and that's, that's partly due to, to, uh, supplementation, to good food and a good lifestyle, a positive lifestyle. Both your mom and my mom have very positive, uh, mental attitudes. And that helps folks. It helps a lot. And you can be what you want to be out there and be in charge of your own wellness. That's that's one thing Dr. Lang and I preach all the time is to do that. So, yes, I'm looking forward to, to racing next week. I really am. It'll be my first time out there with you in a long time. And, and, and you haven't been out there all that much, so I'm glad to see you getting back behind the wheel again. We're going to have a good time, and we're going to give folks all these updates. But I had a couple of texts uh, that just came in just a little bit ago and sitting here at the desk, and uh, they wanted to know, you know, are we going to do a show next week? Are we going to do, yep, we're going to be in the studio again. We'll be live, and then we're going to shoot over to the Clearwater store for a, a personal appearance over there. So come over, and if you have some questions, I'm going to bring some dumbbells and some weights with me this time. And if people want to know how to how to do a couple certain things or like that in your workout, I'm going to show them. I'm going to bring some stuff over there. We're going to keep it right there at, at the Clearwater store. And when I'm over there, we'll do a little bit of demonstration. Dr. Lang can do the same thing. He's been 